Yes, girl, I'm about to change my name to Library because she is booked. Hey y'all, what's up, it's Jessica, welcome back. Thank you guys so much for tuning in today. Today I have a try on haul for you guys. I've never done, I don't think, an exclusive Zara haul. And to know me is to know that I absolutely love Zara. I shop there all the time. Basically, Zara is like my second home. I'm always there, whether it be in store or if I'm just browsing online, which happens to be like my favorite thing to do. Zara has so many incredible pieces. I feel like it's like for the girl who's super like cutting edge, very fashion forward, but she want to save her points. So I got a lot of new bits in that I want to share with you guys um, because I don't know, it's springtime. You know, we're feeling inspired. We want to update our wardrobe. I found a lot of pieces that I'm excited to add to my wardrobe just to streamline it a bit, make it a little bit more, you know, stylish. All right, y'all, I'm excited to try on these clothes. So let's go ahead and get started. Okay, so first item is this pair of mom denim. I freaking love the cut of these jeans. Like, I love mom denim because it's so comfortable. Plus, y'all know how I feel about high-waisted denim. Like, I don't like anything lower, low rise. It's just not comfortable for me. But this one fits so well. The fit is great. I love wearing it with like crop tops or you could wear it with like a t-shirt tucked in. Um, but I just love the fact that mom jeans are just so dang comfortable. And also I love the distressed detail at the knee. So we have like this cut out detail at the knee. It's um, like a straight leg denim. So they go kind of straight, kind of cropped, like they hit right at the ankle. I've been wearing these a lot lately. They fit comfortably. I do have some room right here though. And I think these are a size I want to say it's a US 2. I love the wash of these jeans too. It's like a true denim. They kind of give you that warm in look. They fit nice on the bum. It kind of reminds me of like that 90s denim. So I'm totally living for these. I feel like the 90s had some of the best jeans. Okay, so this t-shirt right here caught my eye instantaneously because it's just dope. So there's this girl on it and then it says living in LA. I, I, how can I not? from LA, live in LA, born and raised. It just screamed Jessica, so I had to get it. I love graphic t-shirts that are just super relaxed. This is like kind of loose fitting and a little big, but I love that about it because it gives me the ability to like customize it. Like if I wanted to tie her in a little knot right there, that's cute. I can make that a moment. If I wanted to like tuck her in my denim or something like that, like, there's a lot of different ways that you can do relaxed t-shirts. I can, it's just a lot of different looks you can do with this, but I love this t-shirt. I think it's super cool, very like stylish. On those casual days where I don't really feel like getting dressed and I just wanna throw something cool on that's kind of effortless, this is the type of thing that I would do. I would wear it with denim um, and then like an oversized t-shirt and then throw on like a leather jacket over it with some boots, call it a day, and I look good. So the next item is this tunic dress. And when I first saw this, immediately I was like, that print is fire. I needed this dress so bad. Right when I saw it, I was like, I need it. So it's this very sheer material, but what I love about it is the fact that it has like this abstract kind of vibe and print to it. The colors are very like wearable, kind of like muted, but bright at the same time. And I love the fact that it is so multicolored because I could wear pretty much any shoe I want with this and rock it and it'd be, you know, okay. I don't like to feel so restricted in my clothing. I like for my my clothing to feel very just like easy going. Like I'm not trying too hard, girl. Fashion should not be so hard. It should feel easy. It should be something that's effortless. So I love this whole look. It's kind of, it kind of has that high low, like the front is higher than the back. It has like the side slit, which I think is cute. It's kind of giving me like 90s Lisa Bonet type of vibe. I feel like she, I, you could catch her rocking something like this in the 90s. I could see it. So another feature that this dress has is this tie right here. And at first I was like, what, like, what the heck am I going to do with this? Like tie it in a bow or like maybe just knot it or something. I don't know. I feel like that kind of looks closed, but then at the same time, it looks cute. So I don't know if I would tie it. Maybe put this to the back and only tie one. What I love about it is that it looks like a scarf. Like maybe if you do something like that, 
yeah, it's super cute. I love this. I just love this whole little look. I also got these shoes from Zara, which I think would be so cute with this outfit. Maybe even like a white shoe. But these are from Zara. It's these really cute faux suede um, orange slingbacks with a little kitten heel. Girl. Okay, I am all the way here for this. When I saw this online, I stopped everything I was doing. I stopped everything I was doing, copped it, didn't look back, had no regrets, nothing. This is so, y'all, I have been wanting for the longest time a matching suit set. Like I wanted like the whole monochromatic like suit set look. And um, a lot of places sell them, but I just, I don't know, I never hopped on it. I wanted it, but never hopped on it. But when I saw this one, I was like, no, you're not passing this up. You need to get this. And the color is perfect for spring. I got it in the size extra small. It fits really well. See, it has this little tailored look, gives you a nice waist. I got the matching pants to it. And I just think overall, this is a super cute look. Like I can see myself rocking this just as is. Obviously ironed, so there's no wrinkles, but I can see myself the pockets okay so I, I like pockets so this is kind of like bugging me but I'll just have to like put it in my head that the pockets aren't there so I don't look stupid have you ever done that before where you're trying to like put your hand in the pocket and you're just like why why isn't this not working and you look down and you're like oh so that's the only thing I like pockets I like to be able to put my hand in pockets but you know girl you know I'm just stand just like this boom I think this is so cute oh I bought some earrings oh <gasps> the earrings I got these earrings from Zara. Don't mind my ratchet nails. I got these earrings from Zara. These are so cute. Let's put these on. Ooh, the earrings look so cute with this. Okay, yes. You did that, girl. I love this, you guys. And the fact that I could wear the trousers by themselves with like a t-shirt, maybe even that t-shirt I showed you guys, the graphic white t-shirt, I could wear with that and some sneakers. I could wear the jacket with some denim. And like, I can get so many looks from these two pieces. So that's why I love separates because um, when you think about it, you're getting a lot of wear out of these two pieces. So I can layer this over denim. I can layer it over a dress. I can wear this with a sweater. I could wear this with another suit jacket, maybe even something that's uh, textured or something like there's so many different looks you can get with these two pieces. So always think about that when you see like matching suit sets and stuff like that. Think about the wear, the longevity and wear that you're going to get out of those two items and all the separate outfits you're going to get from these two pieces. It's so hard for me sometimes to find suit pants that fit well because I'm so petite and sometimes they just don't fit, but these fit. They, they fit okay. They're not supposed to be tight. They're supposed to be relaxed. Um, so yeah, that's that's what I got going on. I love where they fall. They fall, if you guys can see, they fall like right at my ankles so they're not too long. And that's another thing. Everything is just so long on me because I'm so short. And that's like a problem that I have with like finding things that fit because I'm so little. So I love the fact that I found a suit that fits my small frame. Like, can you guys just see this outfit? like this cute maybe with some sunglasses girl this is a look oh i'm so excited i'm excited for spring girl okay yes girl i'm gonna change my name to library because she is booked <laughs> i probably would rock it with these like white mule looking slingbacks these are so cute. I also bought these from Zara and I think this would be super cute with this outfit. What do you guys think? All right, so I threw my hair up in this bun because I want to share with you guys the look really quick. You guys know how I get. I get inspired and I just want to share it. But I got this belt bag from Zara. Actually, it's a two in one. Like you can wear this as a belt bag or it comes with a strap where you can wear it just as a regular like strappy bag or like a um, crossbody. But it does come with a strap. So it's a two in one, which is good. But I prefer to wear it as a belt bag. I put some shorts on underneath because this look right here would be so cute. Just picture this look as a dress with the blazer on as a dress and with some super cute like boots, maybe like some white boots or something. I love this bag. Belt bags are literally on trend right now. They've been on trend for a cool minute. I want to say the past two seasons, they have been super just in our faces and I love them because they're convenient especially for me I don't like carrying a lot of stuff I like stuff for fanny pack all day that's just my vibe if you wanted a more affordable version of the Gucci bag I feel like this is a an inspiration of the Gucci belt bag which can run you up to like 
12, 2,000, 1,200, 2,000 um, dollars. But if you want to save your coins, girl, I do. Then this one I feel like is super nice. Like it's not leather, but the quality and the look of it, this black with the gold hardware, you can't go wrong with this. This will just blend right into your wardrobe, make your outfits outfits pop without you spending too much money on your look tell me this is not a cute look you guys with the bun oh i have to take pictures in this look i have to take pictures i'm starting my fashion blog it will be out super soon um i'm working on it but this this is gonna have to make an appearance because she is ready she got the receipt all right, so this is another suit jacket that I got from Zara. I really, really love this one. I'm trying to stock up on my suit jackets because I don't really have a lot in my wardrobe, like blazers and stuff. So I want to accumulate some so that I can build kind of like a collection so that throughout each season, I can pull it out and I don't have to buy anymore, if that makes sense. But this one, I love when I saw it. I actually saw another Zara haul of some girl. I don't even remember her name, but I was watching her. And she had this on. I was like, that's from Zara? So I immediately went to Zara, bought this. I have mine in a size. I believe this is an extra small, but it's kind of like big. I believe, I think the look of this is supposed to feel more relaxed. It's supposed to feel more loose. And I really love it. Like this is super cute. I would wear this as a dress or I would even wear it like over some jeans because I think that might be cute. But I love the fit of this. It actually came with, it didn't come with, but they do sell like match, matching trousers, but when I went to go try on the trousers, the extra small was huge. So the, the sizing on that was kind of off. Maybe that's what it is. Maybe the sizing is off. Cause even though this is supposed to be relaxed and big and stuff, it still fits kind of large. Like see how low it goes to my hands. I know that's the look, but um, even the trousers were way too long and they were way too big. And I would have to spend more money trying to tailor it. And I didn't feel like doing all that. So I just got, the jacket and the jacket is so cute this is a piece you can transition from spring to summer uh to fall winter like you can wear this all year round which i love about it yeah this is really cute like you know throw on your sunglasses i think cat eye sunglasses with this is a winner girl throw your hair up in the bun put on some cat eye sunnies and these aren't from zara i got these from forever 21 but they're inexpensive you can wear it like that and you're ready to go. I think this will look cute with this belt bag. This is also from Zara. Um, when I saw the black one, I was like, I have to have the red one. And again, this is like such a good dupe for the, it's not a replica, but it is a dupe for the Gucci belt bag. And I think this is so cute, you guys. I love this. It's just like the black one, except for it's in red. And I think the red up against the mustard would be so hot. This is so cute. I literally love this look. And then you could throw on your Gucci shades. So you don't have to spend $1,200, $2,000 on a Gucci belt bag. Just get your Gucci shades, which is a lot cheaper than the belt bag. And you still have that high, low, in cost effect. You get what I'm saying? See how we do that? We're so smart over here. This is something that I would wear. Like this is so cute, especially for spring. It's a good take and playful way to kind of switch up your whole like blazer look, wear it as a dress, wear it as a layering piece, wear it as a suit, so many different options. Okay, I also bought these boots from Zara, these red boots. They're like sock booties, but I love this block heel. Like the heel had me like, I love it for sight. The boots are so cute. Like I had to have these boots. This with the boot, I think this is super cute. I love the whole mustard ketchup effect. These boots are super comfortable too. Like I could wear these all day long and my feet would not hurt. I think a red booty is essential in your closet. So if you don't have a red booty or pair of boots, girl, cop them, okay? Cause you're gonna thank yourself later for buying it. They can go through summer with you, fall, winter, like red is a staple look, especially in your shoes. They just give that pop to your outfit. You know what? I'm gonna do a spring lookbook so you guys can just, just see what I'm talking about, okay? Yes, if you wanna see a spring lookbook, let me know in the comment section. I think a spring lookbook, because this out, the outfits that I have in my head are so dope that I have to share it. So regardless, I'm gonna share it, I'm gonna do it. But here is, the, the um, belt bag, jacket, and boots from Zara. This is a look, this is an outfit in itself. This is not even a look, but I'm just trying on stuff and coming up with outfits. Just, that's just what we do. Okay, so the next item that I bought was this super cute asymmetrical 
very like retro it's giving me retro vibes polka dotted pink dress i don't own anything like this in my wardrobe and i wouldn't normally like gravitate towards it but i'm just really trying to kind of i'm trying to take my wardrobe up a notch so that i have something for every occasion and i think it's imperative for a girl to have pretty girly dresses in her wardrobe just you don't need a bunch just a few because you just never know and they're kind of timeless so i love this dress right here it has like ruching right here which is forgiving because i have a bit of a like belly because she be eating a lot i have a size extra small i would wear this with like some white booties oh and these earrings let me show you the earrings look at how adorable these earrings are you guys i got these from zara as well Aren't these earrings adorable, you guys? They're so girly and cute. Like when I saw these, I was like, girl, yes, I need them in my wardrobe. I'm all for big, just statement earrings. They're just gonna make your outfit pop. And I love what it does for this entire look. So girly. But this is the dress. It's really cute. I like it. It is kind of tight right here. I always get it extra small, but this is kind of like tight. And if you are busty, which I am not, then you might have some issues with this part right here, like gapping, maybe like, I see some women who are like super busty and then it like caves in right here. So you might have an issue with that with this particular like silhouette. But if you are a part of the itty bitty titty committee, like myself, then this dress will fit you perfectly fine right here. Cause you know, we ain't got nothing nowhere, so. <laughs> Doesn't this just scream spring? Okay, so next I have this jumpsuit and I love the print of this jumpsuit. I think it's so, I love muted colors because I just think about how many different things I could wear and do with it. This one is muted stripes. The colors are earth tones. It's really, really, I, I'm just here for it. I think it's a really good look. I'm on my tippy toes right now because I want to show you guys like the leg of it, but they don't, they're not too long. And I find a lot of jumpsuits are just way too long. Like who are you dressing? Goliath, like hello, there's some itty bitties out here too. And we can't fit all these long things and nor do we want to always have to go get them tailored. Like, can you just make stuff, give us options, sis. That's all I'm asking for is options. This is really cute. I thought this would be like one of those cute, relaxed outfits you could wear for like summer. And I would wear this all year round, honestly speaking. I, I'm just one of those people who loves relaxed, easy outfits. I don't like to feel restricted in my clothing. Like, as I mentioned before, I just love this whole, and I'm a bohemian at heart. I love bohemian pieces. Like I just live for bohemian style. This, when I saw this at Zara, I was like, Jessica, get it. And when I saw this, I was like, okay, what layer piece could I wear with it and I saw this super gorgeous like oversized vest at Zara and I also copped it so here is the oversized vest that I copped isn't this gorgeous oh my god so it's like this black suede it has the grommet detail and then it has like the feathers on like I just I had to have it it screams my style it just screams my style I love this look so much, especially with the braids. When are they casting for the next Star Wars? Cause I already feel like I got the part with this outfit. I'm gonna just walk up in there like, the force is with you and I'm hired, I'm booked. <laughs> okay, so here's the next one. And when I say this is Jessica in a nutshell, this is, this is all me right here. It's this oversized t-shirt dress but I love like the cut of this. So it's kind of like at the bottom, you can see it's kind of asymmetrical, that little dance I'm doing right there. <laughs> it was fitted at the bottom, but this sleeve detail right here, like can we talk about this sis real quick? This will take your, I don't feel like getting dressed, I'm just going to the store outfit to the next level. I freaking adore this. Like even if I was to like belt this, belt her in, oh my God, she would be, she'd be cute. Even without the belt, like I like it like this. This is such an easy, cute outfit. Zara, I'm, I'm telling you, they nail it with these just basic outfits, like super basic silhouettes, super basic colors. But when you put them on, you don't feel basic. And then it has like a graphic right here, which says love as an offering. And literally I would put my, throw on my denim jacket, put on my slides, go to the grocery store, go run errands and feel like I don't look like a slob. <laughs> But sometimes I feel like that, like I'm like, oh, I'm like getting dressed 
and I don't want to look like that when I'm out in public so this just gives me a reason to wear my very comfortable t-shirt dresses but just in a more stylish put together way yeah I'm seeing this in my head I see it with like a pop of yellow I could literally dress this up or dress it down even if I were to get one of those chain like those chain belts and if I were to go to an event wear some strappy heels a chain gold belt uh, my hair in like a sleek little ponytail to the back and then just some earrings and cl a cluster of earrings. I look like I put a lot of effort in my outfit and this is just like a $19 oversized basic. I sleep in it sometimes dress but you'll never know. That thing? Yeah, this is, this is it girl. You need to have some dresses like this in your wardrobe. Take your comfortable pajamas that you love to wear out in public or put that back in the pajama drawer and get you some of these. I don't even know what to say about this, but let's just say when I saw it, it was like literally a moment where I just stood there and I was like, I was lost for words. I had to have this. I had to have it. I had to have it. <laughs> like I had to have this. This is this nude mesh ruffled polka dotted dress with red polka dots. It's sheer, it's not even mesh, it's sheer. Can I? Can you say that? Sheer, Jessica, can you say that? And I love the fact that I could wear this as a dress or I could wear it like I'm showing you right now. I wouldn't wear it with this particular bra. I would wear it with like a bralette or something like that. Um, but I don't feel like grabbing it, so it is what it is. <laughs> but I love the fact that I could layer it over denim and it'd be a look, I could wear it as a dress with like something underneath it and that'd be a look. Or the look that I really have in mind is like an oversized knit, maybe in like a tan or a taupe color, very oversized. And then I wear that red belt bag with it, a red beret and those red boots. That is a look. I'm telling you guys, I'm gonna get these look looks out and you're gonna see what I'm talking about because it's in my head. The visions are in my head, but I putting them out you will see and you'll be like sis i get it that's a look but i love this so much i feel like this could be intimidating because the first thing people think about is oh it's see-through i can't wear that but you you definitely can you could put a cami underneath you could put a bralette underneath you could put something over it so that this is just like an under like an underlay thing and what it does is it makes it look like it's a skirt as opposed to just a dress that's what i'm talking about like getting more bang for your buck okay how many looks and pieces can you do with this one piece is that a series that I should do on my channel? Actually, you know what? Let's make that a series. Like a one piece, four ways, three ways, five ways, whatever. Just so you guys can see like some of the items that you may have in your wardrobe right now that are just sitting there. She's only been giving you one look. I'm gonna show you how you can get multiple looks out of that one thing. So we're, we're definitely gonna add that this season to the series because I feel like stuff like this it just screams just oh my god i just i'm sorry i'm just looking at how she's looking with this dinner with the distress right here and i'm getting my life this is like chicken pox on steroids if chicken pox were fashionable this is what it looked like if chicken pox was a dress it'd be this even with like a red lip like oh my god like i i'm loving i'm minus the bra i'm loving this whole just vibe i love it so here's another one of those easy going t-shirt dresses that obviously you guys i i'm obsessed with this because as a mom not just a mom but my personality is very just like easy going very like carefree laid back i'm not on 10 i'm more like on um, chill <laughs> so this is just something that i live in like when i'm going out you could find me in something like this i've actually already worn this way too many times we're not judging but it's just because i love stuff like this i can have a closet full of these and be good to go this one says today's outfit an oversized t-shirt and sneakers like i don't even need to say what i'm wearing my shirt just tells you when you come up to me today's outfit is an oversized t-shirt and sneakers how you doing it's introducing my outfit before i even speak i just love this such a carefree easy going chill relaxed look and, and i i mean although i'm very petite and small i don't know what i'm i don't know why i love oversized clothing i don't feel like it swallows me up i just feel like it just makes me feel very just like 
chill and relaxed and obviously it makes for good layering i don't feel restricted i feel like i can move i can literally jazz this thing up and make it look a lot more stylish than just throwing it on like a lot of times i'll just be putting on something very like in my head very basic i'm not trying too hard and i go outside and people are like oh my god i love your outfit i love your outfit and i'm just like it's a t-shirt dress and sneakers i don't i don't get it but that's the cool part about buying comfortable stylish clothes like you don't have to look like how you feel you feel me like even sometimes when i don't feel like getting dressed i don't have to look like that like i don't feel like getting dressed i put this on i look like i feel like getting dressed right it's still pretty cold outside so even if i were to just layer this jacket which by the way this is from zara my husband bought this for me like look how cool that looks okay just with me layering this over it so you see how cool this looks like today is a very like kind of cool day it's gloomy outside i think it was actually raining and if i were to go outside right now just with this oversized um t-shirt dress on this jacket and some boots maybe get like a backpack i would look put together but literally this is a very comfortable easy outfit like not a lot of effort whatsoever so try to find those basic comfortable clothes that you still feel comfortable you still feel like your lazy self when you're having those lazy days but you don't have to look like it you get what i'm saying i hope that makes sense even with like the pop of red i would wear this like right now i would totally wear this right now i love this jacket like this is such a cool jacket very cute like he did a good job i didn't even help him like he got this for me and this is really such a cute jacket but yeah so yeah i, I love looks like this they're very easy they don't take a lot of effort, don't take a lot of time to get dressed. I can put this on in five seconds and be good. So the next piece is this super cute maxi striped dress. I love it. It has a slit right here on the side just to give you that extra like, uh. I think this is so cute. And again, it's very comfortable. It's one of those relaxed feels. So it doesn't feel like I said, I, I live for just stuff that just feels comfortable. I'm all about comfort. When I wear my clothes, I don't like anything that makes me just feel like I can't be myself. You know what I mean? Like I like to be comfortable. This is so cute. I wore this to an event and I got so many compliments. Um, I styled it with like an oversized uh, bright yellow fur jacket and it literally was cute. I wore that with my red boots and it was, it was a look. Okay. I love this dress. I think it's really, really cute. Um, I would wear it with like red boots, like I said, or even like some flat light sneakers, like all white sneakers or something with like a pop of color. That would be cute if you want to dress her up like for the nighttime or something. You could wear her with some strappy heels and she'd be cute that way as well. So I'm, I love this dress. It's super comfortable, fits really well. We're going to revisit this outfit, restyle her, maybe add her with this and just see the type of look I come up with. Um, incorporating this bag but is this a cute look like even if you're going to an amusement park like if i was going to disneyland or whatever i would wear this outfit with some comfortable shoes some sunglasses a denim jacket and that would be such a cute look and it feels really really comfortable and i love the fact that it's long too y'all this dress right here oh my gosh y'all okay this dress is just she needs no introduction okay this dress is so cute i saw this first time i seen this was on the website and i believe like it wasn't like they show it on the website but i couldn't purchase it like i had to wait uh so i put my my name on the, the waiting list or whatever sent them my email and then when it came in stock i immediately picked her up because i was like that is just a dress that's too good to pass up like doesn't this give you give you like african vibes it's the prints and the colors are just so cute this also is like a matching set it came with mat matching trousers or well, it didn't come with it but there's matching trousers available that i didn't get and i don't know i regret not getting it i don't know why i didn't get it like i kept putting it in my cart then i would take it out put it back take it out i need to stop doing it like i should have got it because i would actually wear it together but nonetheless by itself it's still really cute it's kind of giving you that kimono look i love the fact that it's fitted right here oh my god and the slit like this is a bomb look you could wear this out on vacation like if you wanted to wear this going to like a dinner or lunch on the beach brunch on the beach somewhere this is your summer go-to brunch outfit get you a little cute straw bag with her oh, yes. 
Okay, so next is this super gorgeous gang of print skirt. I love this skirt so much. I actually got this on sale at Zara for a really good price. I believe it was like maybe less than $10. You can't go wrong with that. And when I saw this little detail right here, this ruffle and slit detail, I was like, this is something that I know I'm gonna wear for like ages. Like this is never gonna be something that I would not have in my, my closet because it's just so cute. Whether I wanna wear it with thigh high boots, whether I wanna wear it with some mules, whether I wanna wear it with flats, boots, sneakers. There's so many different looks I could do with this skirt. I would love this with like a t-shirt tucked in, like a white crisp t-shirt tucked in. Maybe something with like a graphic print and um, oversized sungla sunglasses and just an overall cute look with like super big earrings. I don't know. Like I have the look in my head. I wouldn't wear it necessarily with this top, even though this is not something bad either. It's kind of cute. But I just love this skirt so much. You see that right here? So you get the big checker print inside and then right like this is oh my god that is so adorable. Is this reversible? No it's not reversible. Wouldn't that be cute? Like just imagine taking a picture and the wind hitting you perfectly and opening this detail up right here just like that. That shot right there. So here's another skirt that I got that I really love that I, and I also can see myself wearing this this spring and summer is this textured skirt right here with a high slit. You guys know how I feel about slits. I live for them. But it also has like this fringe right here. And what I love about this because I was like, you know what? That looks very like fall-ish. I definitely can wear it for fall. But then with the right pieces paired with it, you can easily transition this to like your summer wardrobe as well. Okay, so just draping this jacket over this outfit. That's a look too, you guys. Okay, I definitely can see myself wearing this jacket with this. Like, I can see myself wearing this. This is a really cute look. Just need the right accessories with it. And this, was, even these simple hoop earrings, that, that would be a look as well. But I think this is so cute together. See this, this, like, see what we're doing here? That series about getting the bang for your buck with your outfits, that's gonna come soon. Cause I could just see that being so helpful to a lot of you guys out there. But I love this skirt. As I was about to take this skirt off, I was like, you bought a jacket that would actually look cute with this. I bought this from Zara. It's this suede purple coat. And if I were to just throw this over this, let's just see what that does. Y'all, that's also a look. This is also a look. I love this jacket. It's so, oh, it feels so good. So many different colors in this particular like style, but I opted for the purple one because I just feel like I don't have anything like this in my closet. And it's just that pop of color that you need to kind of make your outfits pop. Like I would wear this jacket over a black turtleneck and some denim and white boots. That's the outfit right there. Like there's, Take that pop of color, that thing that you walk past and you're like, oh, I'm never gonna wear purple, I'm never gonna wear yellow. Take that item, okay? You're gonna use it with like your basic, so like your basic blacks, your basic whites, your basic denim and just paired with it. It's really gonna elevate your outfit. We will make that a series too. I have so many ideas in my head. I, I put on these clothes and I just, my brain just get to working, girl, just be like working. Okay, so yes, I love this together. This is really cute. Ooh with some gold heel, oh my God, gold strappy heels with this. I definitely need to shave, like, cause my legs are looking a bit <laughs> not cute. But this is a cute nighttime summer outfit that I would wear. You know what I'm saying? Like, this is hot enough for the day and this is cool enough for the night. Cute. All right, so next I have this cardigan, which I'm in love with. I had to have this when I saw it. It's just so easy and just very like casual, but cool at the same time. There's so many different looks you can get with this one particular piece. Let me make sure it has pockets. Now she does come with pockets and y'all know how I feel about pockets. I love me some pockets. Cardigans are a great layering piece. You just throw them over your outfit. They're easy, no fuss layering pieces. And I love doing that. And this one in this print is actually, it's done well. Like I love this plaid print. It's textured, so I love the texture on it. And even with this look that I have with the denim and the crop top, I think this would be really cute because it's like a classic piece. I really love this. Doesn't this give you like 90s feels? I feel like I could like play an extra in Boy Meets World right now. 
I don't know why Boy Meets World. That was my show back in the day. <laughs> All right, you guys, that is the end of the haul. If you guys enjoy these type of videos or you want more fashion videos, like you're craving it, you're like, Jessica, please make more fashion videos. Let me know down below in the comment section. Let's talk, let's chat. I know it's been a while since I made a lot of these videos. So I'm just excited to like get back on the ball of things. Or is it the ball or swing of things? If you want to see more of these videos and you're not subscribed, then all you got to do is subscribe. Subscribe and then turn on your post notifications so you're notified every time I upload. That is all, y'all. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!